Okay. Good afternoon, everyone. Today is a very happy day because uh, we're celebrating all of St. Abraham's graduates, 2021 graduates. Um, this is the sixth year we do this ceremony. And uh, we're always very happy for all of them and very proud of them. And uh, congratulations to all the very proud parents. Okay? So uh, we start with the procession and then uh, we have the ceremony. This time it's a little bit um, different than the years before. Even the number is much smaller. Like we always have around 26, 27 graduates. This year I only heard from 16 graduates. I think because of the COVID and the messages and stuff, many of the people didn't respond. Uh, and also the attendance uh, today, um, we have a total of 16 graduates, uh, but I think only nine of them are um, present today. So um, we're gonna celebrate all. Okay. Uh, now it's the time to start the procession. Come on in, grads. Tahil musikoba. Okay. You can remove the masks for the pictures. Yeah, you can remove the masks. Just, uh, just stand by those windows. Yeah. Okay. Abuna will tell you. Okay. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God. I mean, we're very very happy and very uh, proud of all of you we're very proud of all of you it's uh, it's amazing how the years pass quickly I see a lot of you that were very very young and some of you were not even born when I started to serve in this church to see you growing like this and succeeding in your life is a great blessing Keep going. Life doesn't end at what, at one stage, but it keeps going and going, and going. You need to succeed also in your careers, in forming families. You need to succeed in being good Christians. You need to succeed in many things. But you did it. You did great. Keep going. Don't go for less. As God gave you a lot of talents, use them. Not only in studying, but use them all the way. You're going to be great moms, great fathers, great doctors, great accountants, great engineers, great teachers. You're going to be great in everything. In the future, great families, good, strong Christian families. God bless you all. We're very proud of you. Let's say the names. Uh, go. We're going to complete the presentation now, and then we're going to call on the names.
Congratulations. Okay. As I mentioned earlier, this is our sixth year we're doing this ceremony. And uh, we started the tradition with uh, giving out pillows uh, that have a very nice verse. We started with that verse from six years ago. It's the verse of uh, Jeremiah 29, 11, which says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. So it's a very promising verse for them. It's nice to have uh, this pillow next to them wherever they are sitting. We give this pillow to the undergrad graduates. We have different pillows for the master's and the doctorate degree because they usually get it in the undergrad. So we give them different pillows with different verses when they uh, go further for uh, other uh, degrees. Okay, so now, um, okay, uh, again, uh, there were some mix up some pe people didn't, were not able to make it and, um, today. Uh, so uh, we're going to call on names. Some of the names may not be here today, but if their parents are here, they are very welcome to come to pick up the pillow for their child. Okay? Uh, the first one on our list is Stephanie Hanna. Uh, Stephanie is Susan and Nader's daughter. She's not here, and I don't see her parents are either here too. Uh, <laughs> Stephanie, uh, she earned uh, a Bachelor of Science of Psychology from the University of Maryland, and uh, she's planning to apply for law schools. This is her steps going forward. Okay? So... Uh, we will move now to the next one also. Uh, that one is Marina Grace. She texted me this morning also. They, she and her family could not make it to church. Uh, Marina got a Bachelor of Science in Industrial and uh, Labor Relations with minors in Education, Law, Society, and Inequality from Cornell University. Uh, she's going, actually, she got a job and she's going to work for a tech recruiting company in New York City called NDMO. Okay. Uh, next is Timothy Ibrahim. Yeah. Timothy is here. Timothy earned a Bachelor of Science in History from SUNY Geneseo and uh, he's currently applying for law schools, our future lawyer. <laughs> okay. Next comes Andrew Habashi. Andrew got a Bachelor of Science in Business Economics from the University at Albany. And uh, his plan is to apply for statistical analysis posts at any of the sports organizations like NBA or NF NFL. This is what he's thinking of. <laughs> Next comes Christopher Howard. Uh. This is our engineer. Christopher is a 2020 graduate. Okay, we missed him last year, but uh, kindly he joined us this year. <laughs> so Christopher, uh, last year he got a Bachelor of Science of Compu Computer Engineering with concentration in cybersecurity from the College of Engineering of SUNY Polytechnic Institute. Uh, and actually, he's now currently working. He started working at Lockheed Martin as a computer engineer. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, we have uh, three more undergrads. Uh, I don't know if any of their parents are here. Uh, Mary Bechit. I don't see anyone here. 
Mary Bichit, uh, she got a Bachelor of Science in Biology from St. John University. And Mary is still looking into the possible career advancement options. She hasn't decided yet what's the next step. Okay, the next one is uh, uh, Jonathan Ecladius, Johnny, you all know him. Uh, Shereen and George's uh, son, yeah. So Johnny also, he got a Bachelor of Science from Biomedical, of Biomedical Engineering from the City College of New York, and he will apply for engineering jobs, especially those dealing with the biomedical technologies. Uh, the last undergrad graduate is Christopher Toma. Yeah, I see his mom is here. I saw Silvana. Okay, we want you to come pick up his pillow then. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Christopher Toma. So, Christopher uh, earned a Bachelor of Science of Entrepreneurship from the University of Tampa. And as I said, he got a bachelor in entrepreneurship and he's starting really a new business in Florida. This is why he's not here. He's in Florida now. Because uh, that business is of uh, teaching an interactive personal finance course for high school students with the goal in mind to uh, create a financially literate generation. He wants to teach the kids in high school more about finances and stuff. So, that's good. Uh, now, okay, we're moving into the graduates. The first master's degree graduate. Come on, Samantha, yeah. <laughs> Samantha Ibrahim, master of science in publishing and writing. We got a writer here, be careful. <laughs> She's a great writer. She loved writing since she was very young. Uh, I love her writing, especially when they're not uh, okay. <laughs> 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 so she got uh, the Master of Science in Publishing and Writing from Pace University. And she already started to work um, as a staff writer with In Touch magazine. So you get this magazine and read what she writes. In Touch magazine, she's a staff writer there now. Okay, the next master's degree is Malek Azad. Malek took a different route. He got a master's of divinity from Holy Sophia University and he is planning for a PhD in theology. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, the third master's degree is Monica Sheikh. Come on, Amal. And uh, Yalla, come on. Yalla. <laughs> Um, both of you, yeah? Amal Ramses, congratulations. Wow. Oh. <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> so, yeah. Ah, okay. She's in California? Yeah. Out of Surah. Okay, Morna, uh, Monica, she got a Master's of Physician Assistant from Massachusetts College of Pharmacy and Health Science. And uh, now she is focusing on taking her boards and she's hoping that later on she can find a job as an OBGYN Physician Assistant. Okay, we have professional kids. Okay, next we're going to the doctorate degrees. <laughs> First doctor degree is Marina Ayoub. Come on, Marina.
Marina got a doctorate degree in physical therapy from Demon College in Buffalo. And actually, she already accepted a job offer at Advanced Physical Therapy of Orthopedic and Neuromuscular Rehabilitation. So she's starting to work as a physical therapist already. Congrats, Marina. Okay, next comes Simona Gerges. Simona got a doctorate degree of dental surgery. One more dentist in our church. Okay. And uh, she got it from Toro College of Dental Medicine. And uh, in July, she's going to um, go to NYU Langoon in Arizona for a one-year residency of advanced education in general dentistry. So she's leaving us and going to Arizona, but just one year. One year. <laughs> We're not going to give permission for more than one year. <laughs> okay. And then comes Laura Tahawi. Oh. Laura got a doctorate of psychology. And she got it from Pace University. And she has big plans now to study for her uh, license <laughs> exam. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, two more doctorate degrees, but are, they are not with us here today. And I don't see their families, but we're going to say who they are. So the next one is Christina Botros. Uh, Christina Botros have a doctorate degree of osteopathic medicine from NYIT College of Osteopathic Medicine. Uh, Christina, by the way, got married last week too. So she graduated and she got married. Okay. She went for her honeymoon, but now she's uh, in Ohio because this is where she's going to work. Actually, she's going uh, to Case Western University Hospital in Ohio, Cleveland, for a seven-year residency in general surgery. So we're going to have a surgeon. <laughs> Christina is becoming a surgeon. So proud of her and so happy for her. Okay, next comes Miret Shafi. Uh, Miret, uh, she got a doctorate degree of osteopathic medis medicine also from NYIT College of Osteopathic Medicine. So she went to the same school as Christina. And she will be going for radiology residency at Rutgers, New Jersey Medical School. Miret used to be with us in the church here, but she moved to New Jersey, I think, last year already. So she's no longer living here. But because she was here, she went to school. She said, oh, include me in the graduation. So definitely. So, <laughs> so, uh, so also she's going for radiology. Now uh, we finished all our graduates. Congratulations to all. Very happy for all of you. Very, very proud of all of you. You make us proud from generation to generation. Come for a picture with us. Yeah, yeah. You all come with a picture with Abunas. Yeah. عشان عايز اتخرج. Mabrook Lil Parents. You did a great job.